You know what time it is. That's right, another tight medical movie review just for you. With me, my little beautiful wife over here, Cherise. Hey everybody. So we're back. We got to see 1992 Death Row Records picture. All right, Snoop Dogg recently just took over all of Death Row Records and owns it. And this was the first movie produced by them, I think. Pretty sure. Tyrese Gibson headed up as the lead actor in this movie. Yeah. Right? He's getting old. He didn't look too bad. Right. And then we had Scott Eastwood, who is Clint Eastwood's son. That's right. And he looks just like him. And then, and then, you know, we had we had a, a ghost, a spirit of Christmas past. Maybe. Oh, yeah. Ray Liotta. Yeah, he's one of my favorite actors. Ray Liotta was in this movie. Yeah. Right? Now, Ray Liotta's been dead for, for a while. Okay, rest in peace, Ray. But at that point, like, we're out here and we're like, all right, so what's this movie gonna be like? Okay, we read the details about the Rodney King riots, and then, you know, there's this bank robbery or some sort of robbery that's gonna go on. So we go inside, we watch this movie. And the movie started off, okay. I, I thought it could have been a little bit better, more development of the characters, maybe. Yeah. Right? Like little, you know, tidbits of their past, something that made you relate to that character in some way, shape, or form. But I don't think they delivered that. Tyrese, I think, fell short on that in this movie. Um, I know Fast and Furious is an easy one for him, but this was a lot different. Thank and he's God the you leading. Not that movie, Tyrese. Yeah, he, he's a leading role, right? And the last movie I, I think that this kind of compared to, but baby, that whatever. Baby yeah, boy. Baby boy. Baby boy. <laughs> Right, this kind of kind of remind me of that feel. Yeah, yeah, it did. Yeah, but yeah. I don't think it was. It, I don't think it delivered as much as that movie. I thought that movie no. was a little bit better than this. No, one. I saw Death Row and was like, "Yeah, let's go see it because it's a Death Row movie." I'm like, you know, anything the Death Row produces should be like eh, halfway decent, right? Right? Yeah. yeah. You know, they're just starting off. You know, they're you're on the tiptoes, but you know, I, I thought you know Scott Eastwood was going to deliver. I thought I you know, like Ray Liotta. I want to definitely see Ray Liotta in yeah. his last appearance on film. I agree. You know, what, rating wise, am I gonna give it? I might give it a 2.3. 2.3, I'm gonna give it to you. You know, if you like Death Row Records, you like Tyrese Gibson, then stick to your CDs, everybody. Check it out. I, I, you know, I think it could, it could, it, it had, it had everything it needed. It just didn't come through. And I think it could have been a really good film if it was just pulled together a little bit differently. It was just with right? different people, like all together. No, I don't think that. Yeah. Good. I'm gonna give it a 1.2. 1.2. Yep, and it's because John was with me in the movie. Oh my god. So they only got a rating at all. Damn, I only got 1.2 stars. I knew it was coming, right? <laughs> well, we can't give the movie all the stars because you're sitting next to me in the movie. Could have gave me a five rating. Could have been a zero. zero. Could have been yeah, a zero for the movie. I think I like that one. Yeah, yeah. John always gets 10 plus. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I just really, I mean, I, I really didn't have any uh, expectations whatsoever, but yeah, you shouldn't either. So listen, go check it out. You might like it. You might say, hey, listen, these guys have no idea what they're talking sure. about. Or you might say, these guys are the Nostradamuses of movie reviews. <laughs> they're bringing me this vital information every Little week. do you know. So I don't waste right. my money in Little the movie do theater. do you know, me and John have been going to the movie theaters every single Thursday through COVID and everything. Okay, except for the clothes. But every single Thursday for the past 16 years. So I think we might know a little bit, just a little bit about movies. Yeah. Just saying. So make sure you follow our movie reviews because we got another Titan Medical Movie Review come review very soon. Next so we'll Thursday. see you next time at the movies. At the movies.